Hello, welcome to the Ceramics Mod Spotlight. So one of the first things you want to do for this is to work with ceramics, you obviously need clay. And you need to turn that clay in with bone meal uh, in the first instance into one unfired porcelain or with nether quartz and two clay will get you two unfired porcelain. From there what you can do is make an unfired porcelain block and then you would want to cook that into white porcelain. And what you can do is you can then make these blocks uh, with rose red cactus green lapis. You can make the rainbow porcelain block. And and what you'll see is you can you can basically go through all the different types. They all start on a different color. So for instance in here what I did is I made a five by eight structure with um, so to show the eight different variations of how it's going to start. So you can see it's sort of cycling through all the colors and it's kind of like quite a quite a nice pattern. Uh, I've also got these walls. So there's a couple of walls as well that you can get. So if we look at uh, walls, we've got uh, the ones I've chosen are the sort of the most uh, sort of out there ones, but there are like some interesting ones. We've got brick, marine brick, dark brick, porcelain brick, and that should be it. So yeah, so, so they're the more complex ones. Dragon bricks that requires dragon brick. Uh, yeah, let's have a look at the recipes for them then. So for the la lava bricks, we need a bucket of lava. Um, for the dragon bricks, it requires the dragon's breath. Uh, the rainbow bricks, uh, similar crafting recipe to what we looked at with porcelain bricks, and that requires using the uh, the ingot form, I guess, of porcelain, which is just the when you. Uh, you smell it rather than smelting the uh, the block itself. You would smelt the actual uh, just clay, um, the basic sort of thing there. So yeah. So then, like I said, there are these additional four here. So let's actually just place them down. Um, we can just do one, two, and we'll put this one here. This one here. And we'll just go through the same process. So the golden brick. Let's see how we get this one. So that requires porcelain bricks with a gold nugget. This requires uh, yeah, the, the ingot form with lapis. Okay, so they're called marine, but they don't require uh, prismarine. Then we have the dark bricks ink sack for those, normal bricks and finally we have the porcelain bricks uh, which is just, yeah, which is actually just the sort of the base block. One more thing you can make is this unfired clay barrel just made with some clay. You can actually place it in the world but however you can't interact with it and a lot of the, and the unfired stuff you just can't interact with. So what you may want to do is make a clay barrel or a porcelain clay barrel and this you can actually put fluids in. So if we look here, we press the shift, we can see I've got four buckets in there. Uh, the porcelain clay barrel has got six buckets. So this uh, stores quite a bit more. Now, what you can also do is, I've put down this clay barrel and there's nothing in it at the moment. If I put one, uh, if I just right click here, you can see it's gonna give me a redstone signal of one. And that's gonna, it's, that's gonna say that the total here because this is four, and I put this extension, you can put as many extensions as you want on top. Um, so, and they can be of any any color, but you can't mix and match the the extensions for the clay barrels and the porcelain barrels. So I'd have to put a porcelain barrel extension here, and then this would increase it to twelve. So we've got here, we've got eight, and then obviously I could uh, keep on putting additional additional ones here. If you see if I if I put on another um, uh, extension there you can see that's going to increase it to 18. Uh, but you can mix and match the colors like this or you can just keep the uh, the same color there. And you can see it actually does tell you so for instance if we, once we get to 8 we'll see this is going to be completely full. And for this it would require 18. Okay, and the final uh, piece of this puzzle is the faucets 
porcelain faucets and the porcelain channels. So you can extract from the uh, the barrels either from the bottom or the sides. Uh, you're going to need to place the channel directly below in the block space below. And then it's simply a case, for instance, we've got some uh, a little bit, about 11 buckets in here, about 5 buckets in here. Just right click that and you can see this is going to start building up. And this will start decreasing. And similarly for the um, the porcelain barrels uh, in terms of the the, the downward uh, transport you can see. This will go there. So this you can see is building up and this is losing uh, protein. So thanks for watching.